Hello fellow inhabitants of Pal World and welcome to today's video. Today we are going to be talking about how you can get small Pal Souls to use at the Statue of Power. So you can find them in chests knocking about in the early areas of the game, but the chests are quite hard to spot and so it's a bit annoying. So what we're going to need is a mating pair of knocks because we're going to be collecting their eggs. So the knocks can be found in the early areas as well at night time and they are quite difficult to spot. So this one I have found is right near the starting area, just here on the map. And it's all around the early areas where you'll find them. So just tame them up. They've got quite low health, so be careful if you're high level. I've just thrown a green ball straight at it without hitting it, just to be on the safe side. And once you've got a mating pair, put them in your breeding pen and let them go to work. Make sure you've got cake in the breeding pen. Just keep them in there, collect as many eggs as you can. So for this video, I'm going to use 100 of them to see how many souls I get per 100 killed. You're going to need the meat cleaver, so you can unlock this at level 12 in your technology tab. So make one of those, then throw out one of your noxes. Then when you go to the options of how to command your pal, so for us on Xbox it's the right thumbstick, it'll bring up the wheel, and instead of having the option to pet, you'll have the option to butcher. If you press that thumbstick too early though, you will get the option still to pet. And it feels so awful because you'll pet the pal and then you've got to butcher it and you just feel like the most subhuman scum ever. I'm a terrible person. So we're going to proceed to butcher 100 of these and see how many souls we get. So let the massacre commence. Uh, bear in mind my harvesting settings are on the highest so the amount of souls you get per kill might be different to what I'm getting. So you don't get souls every time, quite often you just get leather, but when I did get the souls dropped for me, I was getting three at a time, so that's really good. And I think they've adjusted it slightly to make it better, because I'm sure when I tried, like, over a week ago, I was only getting two souls whenever they dropped the souls, so I feel like they've upped the drop rate. I could be wrong, but it definitely feels like it. Alright, so this is the 100th pal, and now we will check and see the results. So we got 117 souls for 100 slaughtered knocks. Now for me that feels worth it, uh, depending on your settings, they might, it might not, but this is the only way that I have found to get them other than chests in the starting area. So this for me was just a lot easier. And now I've got plenty of souls to level up my pals at the statue. So hopefully you found this helpful. If you did, maybe leave a like on the video and consider subscribing if you're not already. We got loads of pal world on here and we've got so much more to come. Thank you for watching guys. Have a great day and happy slaughtering, I guess. Now get out there and get butchering. Get the bell on.